Hey, what's up? Welcome to Resident Evil 3. If you followed this channel for any amount of time, I don't think I need to do much of an intro on this one. Just very excited to play this. Let's get into it, shall we? Costumes have been added, of course. Because I did, in fact, do the pre-order. Classic Jill. Eh, Carlos, I don't actually care. I guess we use Classic Carlos just to use it. Hero, nobody cares about Carlos. Alright. Let's begin. Well, yeah, there is no save data. Oh, I hit continue instead of new. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, standard do this. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Authorities are bracing for more rioting tonight. He was knocked out consciousness. Uh, city-wide emergency has been declared. CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern region of the U.S. Officials Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the core values that create the foundation for Umbrella. It's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. Wait a minute, she was wearing pants. They're not saving my costume. Also, can safely say I was not expecting first person. Oh, I'm sure this is temporary. I played the demo. I didn't bother doing a recording of the demo since it was just like a couple days ago. The game was already pre-ordered, so... It's not a case of, like, two where I, you know, waited months. Oh, she's not wearing the standard costume at all. Can I unlock this? Can we just be, like, super wake-up Jill? Bedhead Jill. Looking great, Jill. New haircut. Damn. 
Hey, we beat the game. Here. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. Are you getting out of town, Jill? Just abandoning Raccoon City? Like, it's such a lovely place. Just look at the view. Such a good view. And we have like one whole TV station that doesn't really work properly. Got a lot of books. Got a cop car. Our light works. That's a plus. Oh, it did open. Okay, I didn't see a prompt. All right, let's run it back. Let's try this again. Hey, there's the costume. Yay for impractical miniskirt. Hey, there we go. Now we're in third person. It's weird. I haven't really played Resident Evil 3. But I have attachment to this outfit from Resident Evil 1. It's because it wasn't unlockable in the Resident Evil 1 remake. I don't remember having an elbow pad. Are you, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... Ah! Oh, we're not wasting any time, huh? I'm to mosey. Yep, out the window. Hello, friend. Oh, don't like that. Also, really glad these aren't quick time events. Alright, avoid the fire. There we go, exit. That sounds promising. Starting to feel like we're one on one with the Kool Aid Man. Like, that's gotta be a thing, right? Eventually, there's gotta be like a Kool Aid Man mod. Just make Nemesis yell, oh yeah. I'd play it. Hey, I got a trophy. 
or an achievement. This is the PC version, if you were wondering. And that wasn't already clear. Hey, how you doing? Okay. What was that thing? Tim if I know. But right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. How this all happen so fast? I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like Arclay on steroids. I am a bit. Arclay referring to the mansion from Resident Evil 1. Hey, wait! Down here! Damn it! If you're wondering about the timeline, Resident Evil 3 takes place a day before and then immediately after Resident Evil 2. Also, shout out to Brad, the helicopter pilot from the first game. Yeah, let's not deal with that. Do I even have a gun? I don't think I do. Door behind you, go! Don't think about it. We're gonna make a run for it. Come on, Jill. We know how this ends. No, I don't. Are we still a team? Always. Then do me a favor. Don't fuck up like I do. Go! Yeah. Alright, we'll probably rip Brad. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, you don't need this. Of course. Probably shouldn't even try to shoot it. Probably should have just run. Uh, zombies will never figure out how to crawl. Alright. You can just stay on the bus. You know what, I'm just gonna go over here. Y'all can have the bus. That's fine. Parking garage. Got it. Parking garage roof, you say. Sir, are you alright? Stay back! Don't come any closer! Hey, come on. There's a helicopter waiting to take you to safety. What safety? I'm not going out there! The parking garage isn't far, I can tell. The only safe place is in here! What's your name? I can't just leave you behind. It's Dario Rosso. And yeah, right. You just want to steal my safe house. Get your own, Missy. Missy? Missy, really? Would you please calm down? I'm a police officer. I'm here to help. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you've been doing a bang-up job. You want to help? Go handcuff yourself to one of those freaks. How much dialogue do you have? Sir, this is your last chance. No one else is coming for you. I'm not going anywhere! I'd rather starve to death in here than be eaten by one of those undead monsters! Now leave me alone! Is that it? Alright. He's made his choice. Oh good, dogs. That's what we need right now. Hello, sir. Hey, oh, yeah, you stay in there. That's where you are best suited. Ain't sure there's no ammo or anything laying around here. Shit. Is 
So you might have saw there, that's a new feature added to three. Is that little dodge move. I like that we essentially started the game in caution. Ah, good. Anytime now. It's my turn, bitch. Good, now he's on fire. I think we're in the clear. Hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Oh, come on. Who's the dipshit that closed this? Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. <laughs> Listen, I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. UBCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? We're just here to help people. What's wrong with Umbrella? What's wrong with Umbrella? Oh my god. Your company is responsible for infecting everyone! Yeah. But I don't know anything about all that. But you don't have to trust me. But I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on. It's this way. Okay, I think we're about to the point where the demo started. We should make kind of quick work of the next section. Hey, Captain. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. 
I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have played this part. This is the demo. Ammo crafting guide, so this is our gunpowder, that's back from two. Okay, so two gunpowders is handgun, shotgun is gunpowder plus high grade, two high grade is mag ammo. Got it. Did it give me any gunpowder? It did not. Hey, it's Eric Magazine again. It's a bestseller. Jill? It's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You mind getting the subway infrastructure back online? And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Now, I suppose in timeline this is the day before too so that's the same issue ah herbs oh, lots of stuff yep green herb green herb there's some gunpowder two gunpowders My nose. My nose. Cool. And we've got our standard knife. Need some kind of key for this. That's interesting. I don't know if that was in the demo. If it was, I didn't see it. Oh, safe room. Cool. And this is about mixing herbs. Okay, so there's no blue herbs in this one, it looks like. It's fine. Blue herbs were a little awkward to use. Typewriter. It almost looks like I could get this working if I plug in the right whatever it is. Alright, so we found two things we need access to. Go ahead and save. It doesn't look like there's anything over there. Survivors, we've 
gotta get that train moving. How you doing, sir? All right, you like that dodge? That was great. It would have worked, except there was a rail there that I didn't pay attention to. This side clear. That guy's following me. That. Guy's not following me anymore. Right, Y'all stay dead. Stay nice and dead. All right, Y'all stay in there. Everybody stay behind the barricades. Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. <sighs> Fuck you. This still has got some attitude. I like it. Gotta put this out. All right, so we need something for that. Hey, hey, knock it off. I need you guys to behave. I'm just gonna do a little bobbing and weaving. And we're gonna make a way up here. Alright, so we got two paths. This up here. Yeah, that looks safe. I'm sure you're going to just stay there and not be a problem. I have missed mouse aiming. It has actually been a surprisingly long time since I played something with mouse and keyboard on the channel. I've been using a controller for so long. Alright, drop that. Gives us a shortcut back to the uh, burning alleyway. No, I didn't want to go down. There's zombies down here. Nope, you stay up there. Oh good, you're still alive. Good shot. All right, I should keep her down. All right, so we've established a shortcut. Ooh, a safe. Yeah, we're gonna need a combination. This is the drugstore owner's journal. This new hair tonic from Umbrella is just flying off the shelves. The stuff they make always works wonders. So it's no surprise I was counting on this and ordered a huge shipment. My instincts are paying off, literally. Just know sales will continue to rise as word gets out. That said, 
The string of violent incidents on the news has me worried. Maybe I ought to invest in a good safe to hold all this cash that's rolling in. The new safe is just perfect. Nobody knows the code, not even my wife. It's a secret between me and my beautiful Aqua Queen, Aqua Cure Queen. And she'd never give it to a thief. So this is the drugstore owner's place. Yes, I would love some gunpowder. You dead? You are now. Anybody else? All right, looks like we're clear. All right, not skimping on the ammo. Suppose I can't complain about that. Not going that way. And it brings us back to the streets. That's where I went up, I think. Oh, no, there's the donut shop, so that's where I came down, right there. So over here should be the pharmacy, a.k.a. the drugstore. Like they just keep sitting up into the shot. Oh, high grade gunpowder. Nice. Don't know why that's in a pharmacy. More handgun ammo. Oh, hey, look. It's the Aqua Cure. So we have left nine, right three. Left seven. There's the safe combination. Like I said, this is all from the demo. Oh. Use that. Hopefully there'll be more herbs in the near future. Now let's go back and get the safe. Was left nine, right three, left seven. Left, right, left, nine, three, seven. Yep. No, it was left, nine. Right? No. Nine. There we go. I don't know why that was awkward to inputting with a keyboard. Dot side. That's kind of nice. I don't know how helpful that is, really, with the 
crosshair already, but... Sure. Take it. I'm sure it does something. Alright, let's head in here. Never believe them. Ah, fire hose. Yes. That's a thing we probably need. Subway employees memo. Violence getting worse and worse these past few days. Got a shotgun for when it hits a breaking point. Locking it up in the gun rack. That should keep it safe from any would-be looters while I go out and try to find some more shells. If things go south, cut the chain and bust out that sucker. I pray we all make it out alive. Oh, a grenade. Sure. Do I even have what I need for this? Somehow doubt it. Like, can I just shoot it? Alright, so I need something else for that. And there's some more gunpowder. There's the shotgun. Don't have a way to cut the chain. Pretty sure I know where those are. So let's explore the rest of this first. This must be the subway company's offices. Kite Bros Railway Manual. Ensuring safe subway operations. In the event of a power outage, the subway will automatically cease operations. Once power has been restored, please use the control panel to confirm the stations at which the train will stop, as well as which track segments will be used. If the route entered is unsafe, an error will occur and operations will not resume. That sounds like an upcoming puzzle. Okay, I really need whatever this key is. Because that's now two locked boxes and a uh, lock locker. Sir, you stay dead. Okay, yeah, we don't need to go to the pharmacy, we need the other way. Need to get into the donut shop. Alright, all of you gather round. Just everybody group up. Group hug. So nice that somebody left that barrel there. So I can get into the alley back here. Oh, more handgun ammo. Nice. How many little hidden things? I know there are collectibles scattered around. There's little statues or bobblehead things you can destroy. I'm uh, not really concerned about those. I'm not actively looking for them. In fact, I'm pretty sure I've already walked by one that I found in the demo. All 
All right, lots of gunpowder. Another locked locker. Oh, and a safe room. With a fancy box. That I can't pick up. Herb. Alright, let's drop some stuff off. Store, store, store. Store the gunpowder for the time being. Got the fancy box, grab the herb. Examine the fancy box. Red jewel. The invitation ru or an imitation ruby looks like it's made to be slotted into something. I examined the ruby. Okay, that's new. That was not in the demo. That's intriguing. Okay, save again. And I think that's a good place to wrap up for now. So, uh, yeah. Welcome to Resident Evil 3. I'll see you next time for more. See you then.